That missing $450 million Da Vinci painting is reportedly on Saudi Crown Prince MBS yacht. Here's a summary of the article. A Leonardo da Vinci masterpiece, whose whereabouts has been a mystery since it sold in 2017 for a record $450 million, has turned up in an unlikely place, according to Artnet.com. Salvatore Mundi is being kept on Supiot Serene owned by Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman, the publication reported Monday, citing two principals involved in the transaction that it didn't identify. Another Saudi prince was said to have purchased the 500 year old painting on MBS's behalf at a 2017 Christie's auction, the New York Times reported previously. The Saudi government's Center for International Communication didn't immediately respond to a request for comment. Salvatore Mundi, whose provenance has been questioned, will remain aboard MBS's 439 foot serene until the Saudis create a planned cultural hub in the kingdom's Al Ula region, Artnet said. The project was in an exploratory phase, a spokesman for the commission overseeing the plan said in December. Experts at the Louvre have attributed the work to Da Vinci's workshop, rather than to the artist alone, according to a published report. This post received a score of 24,363, with an upvote ratio of 75%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Well, it's not exactly missing if it was legally purchased. It was just whereabouts unknown. Greater than a Leonardo da Vinci masterpiece, whose whereabouts has been a mystery since it sold in 2017 for a record $450 million, has turned up in an unlikely place, according to Artnet.com. Yeah, nowhere does the article imply that the painting was stolen, for the people who don't read articles. And why is that an unlikely place? It's the Prince of Saudi Arabia. Give a list of potential people who may have bought it and include his name and a huge percent of people would guess he had been the buyer. I would have guessed that he would put his expensive paintings in a house, not on a boat. You never pay tariffs on a boat. And you don't pay tax to another country when you sell it later if it's on a boat. And when they try to overthrow your government and you have to flee the country, you can always hide your boat. Art on boats is a great way to hide and launder money. If he needs to pay someone $450 million without anyone knowing he just gives them the painting. Art is like trading cards for the ultra-rich, and a boat is the shoe box they take to other people's house to show things off. Boat, it's 439 feet long. Hey guys I'm back. Just went on an hour-long Wikipedia excursion learning about yachts. They cost a lot is what I've learned. Every day is a school day. Is that why I never want to get out of bed and just play video games and watch The Price is Right? Greater than Da Vinci painting. This painting has not been verified to be from the hand of Leonardo da Vinci. So a painting that may or may not have been painted by Leonardo da Vinci was purchased by a rich man and placed on his boat. Why is this news? And why is it implying it was a stolen? Breaking news, man who anonymously purchased painting, still has it. The real news was that if the painting is not by da Vinci then it's probably money laundering. Need to transfer 450 million to pay for illegal stuff with a seemingly plausible explanation. Make a fake priceless painting. Sell it for the illegal payment price. Profit. They've been debating the authenticity of the painting for decades and it's sold many times. This time it was sold by one of the oligarchs whose name keeps coming up in the Russia investigation if I'm not mistaken. The provenance is questionable, the authenticity is questionable, the auction estimate was that it would sell for $150 million, but it went for three times that. But, the auction house gets paid too, so they're perfectly happy to sell it as the real deal. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.